episodes of Life is Strange. Whoa. We call the film Little Pieces of Time. I'm doing great. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. Don't ever trying to get some rest this week. It totally makes sense. How about you? You hell saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. <laughs> You're my business now. That's and Rachel's I... bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? We still Please don't know why. step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Yeah, we saved her. That was awesome. What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee. Why exactly were you on the roof with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is Tabor? this? Yeah, that was epic. That was awesome. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Yeah, Warren's definitely got a crush on Max. Hey, 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 what's up, vet? My dog. How you doing, bud? Yeah, another stream. Finishing up uh, episode three. All right, all right, all right. Life indeed is strange. I'm loving this, these episodes so far, man. They're so good. Stuff's gonna go down. You don't get off lockdown until June. Yeah, we'll probably be about that long as well. Kate! Something to show you. Meet me in front of campus. Get that SD. I knew Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Oh, don't forget to water our plant. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. Wait, you do it too much? Are you a hungry bunny? Here, nosh on this. I don't know, you could overwater it. Switch it off. Yeah, cute bunny. Maybe I should get a bunny instead. Alright, let's see. Glad the media doesn't waste a second exploiting Kate. Ah, now she has geez. another video of herself all over the web. Jeez. Hmm. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. I sure hope these people treat her better when she comes back to school. If she does. Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Okay. Everybody will be talking about Kate now. Blackwell might as well shut down for the next month. You know you're hurting when you don't give a shit about music. Ew. Thanks for the image, Nathan. And everybody here thinks Samuel is a creeper? Yeah, that's... Yeah, June. 
Jeepest, I am so freaking tired. <laughs> I sound like a moron. But crime does not delay. <sighs> Kate's okay, Max. Take a breath. Get your shit together. You have time. Pretty hard to focus on my class schedule this week. I wonder yeah, why. I'm sorry, at, uh, you, you're stuck in, in lockdown. It's probably for the best because UK, I think, is even worse than the US right now per capita in terms of COVID. Okay, this so, is scary dark. Y'all gotta... <laughs> Let there be... Something's gotta be done. They need to take care of you guys, though, because it's, it's, it sucks. Wherever you go, there I am. That's a depressing thought. And it's always about Victoria. Yeah, Victoria sucks. Did they switch anything? Where the hell are you, Rachel Amber? The vaccines are helping. Uh, so it could be sooner. That's awesome. I'm glad. I'm very glad to hear that. Let me speak with Taylor. Hey, Max. Best of luck to you, Molly. I hope you get vaccinated. I can't believe she tried to jump. I can. I'm just so glad she didn't. Doesn't have to blame anyone. Are you okay? I'm just like shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave me. Exactly! Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Ooh. I won't say a word. I swear to dog. I believe you, Max. Besides Victoria, you're the only one who asked me about my mom in the hospital. That meant a lot to me. I'm my own person, too. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. I don't need to know you're where You're, like, Victoria's. weird, but pretty cool, Max. <laughs> Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Let's freaking go. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. It's rough out there. Wait, reverse? Interesting. Max. I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Oh man, like, you saw her? She was so, like, nervous <laughs> when she left the dorm. <laughs> she wouldn't even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Well, I have to go crash. <laughs> it's been a rough day, as you know. Thanks, Max. And it was, like, pretty awesome when you went up to the roof to save Kate. Victoria was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Max. I can. I'm just... Me neither. I'm my own person. Where did she go? I know I can trust you since you were so nice asking about my mom in the hospital, but Victoria will, like, make my life hell if I blab, okay? No doubt. I do hope your mother gets better. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. Alright, alright. So then I'll, I'll go back, get that Victoria point. Yeah, because it doesn't make a difference. Yeah, drama's annoying. Oh, Probably. I'd love to say it's Thanks, exaggerated, Max. but not always the case. Victoria was wrong. All right. Am I missing anything in here? I hope Victoria feels particularly shitty about posting that link. Yeah, that was. God. Kate probably won't want to look at these posters when she comes back. Jeez. Okay, then let's let's go. Uh, I guess. Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time, going through her shit. Since Victoria is about as street as me, but she really appreciates style. A unique point of view is right. 
thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the Chase space. First Rachel and now Kate. This is the end of the Vortex Club. Well, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. Hey, sweetie, what up? I'm just avoiding some lame homework. Some do some homework. Some homework. Give it to live. Like watching another one. See if I'm still Yes, I feel like total. Everything I said about that. Can you meet up later? This girl needs a drink. Do it to Kate. What a trip that was seeing Max and Kate like that. I need a drink too. Let me know. Hmm. This is like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Oh, yeah. yeah, that. Lame. Cardi on dudes. Got me effing suspect. Okay, so Nathan's talking to Victoria. Are they dating? Can you believe it? My dad owns the effing dorm. She plays with her selfies. My parents have lost their effing job in my dad's office. I don't see to have me repping him. Max, I feel the blood going to go down. End of the world party is on you in. Are you kidding me? That is BS. No way can Blackwell and his was trouble the first. What? Kicking Jefferson with the retro cam era <laughs> camera. Notice that everyone she hands around like, gets in trouble. Yeah, the Vortex will bring the end of the world to Blackwell no matter what. I'll message you later so we can plot in person. Hang there? What? Holy cow, dude. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. That's a lot. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Yeah, that's a yikes. I really don't like Victoria. I can tell she's like a human being, but man. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Oh god, yeah, she definitely got drugged. These socks cost more than my wardrobe. <sighs> Nothing to see here. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. So much hypocrite. Literally, yeah. Oh, God. Do they really need that crap on the door? Kate's still alive. Hey, Max? Come here. Hey, Dana. I think we're all responsible for what happened. True. That was bullshit. Where was everybody else? I know. You're a better person than any of us here. Hey, Max. I think I need to crash now. I'm just over everything today. Dana looks guilty and relieved about Kate. She really does care. Aw, Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. Oh, that's cute. I don't have anything deep or smart to say. I just wanted to be a good friend to Kate. Oh, that's so good. If Dana talks to Juliet about this, she's gonna wish she didn't. Why are you writing an article about Kate for the paper? Why not? I know you want to find more about me. Serve some privacy. True. 
Yes, the Vortex Club does indeed suck. This is both sad and pathetic. I am wiped out, Max. We'll talk later. Dana's really hurting over this. Just want you to know you're in our thoughts. I guess it's better than an alternative. They're still hypocrites for, like, not caring until now. Talk to her one more time. I like really do need to get some sleep, Max. Okay, now we're good. Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. I feel so giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Maybe it's the leftover adrenaline. Very nice. Oh, I could have taken a picture of that. Oh, yeah, let me look at the journal, dude. The oh, 41 pages? Okay. Okay, dude. We went, like, 25 pages in. Plot thickens. I can't get out after listening to Victoria and Ragon K. The Nathan could be disturbed. Thought it was just extra setting up this weird galley is effed up. Be more careful. I must want a surveillance system now. If things weren't getting dramatic enough, I get a text from a private number. I had to give Kate's book back. I want to give her room. She's just crying. Yep, yep. I admitted she thinks something happened to her. Just video. Very considering her. What the effort is capable of? She go to the police. I told her she's absolutely go. Other people could be dangerous, so she used me as her backpack. Which kind of scares me because of the this text threat. Should I get this involved? Someone's obviously stalking me or worse already. This is getting freakier than a hangle. Supermax, not. I ran into Warren, rather was trying to run into me. Uh, what the hell happened in the Chloe and Nathan show? Uh, do you owe Warren? Yeah, you do. I only told him a little bit what's going on with Nathan. I think it was better for him. I want my ability to reverse time and space, but ironically, I don't think it's the right time or space. Besides, he'd want to marry immediately just so he could have his own human time machine after scientific experiments or make me go to the drive-in with him. I did say I would go to the drive-in with him. Hopefully he doesn't make a lame move on me. Not that he would. Egomaniac. Warren, I do have a lot in common, but he's like a super cool geek brother. Anyway, I need a movie escape. Before catching the bus out to meet Chloe, I saw Nathan talking to David, which made me nervous. So I don't know, better. She was late, duh. Just uh, see me. Didn't give me a guilt trip for not staying in touch. After leaving Dad, she'll move on. Joyce wasn't happy, should have stepped in and taken the hit instead of Chloe. No, I think I made the right choice. I feel bad that Joyce has to defend David for laying the smack down on his daughter. William is always kind and gentle to us. Can't ex imagine how Chloe would be if he hadn't died. Uh, show up more bubbly. I have to admit, I felt like a total boss. Nosebleed, yeah. It's top secret lair. I have two friends at once. Secret lair. Uh, money from Frank. He pulled the knife on us. I almost shot him. Glad there was no bullets. Yep. Uh, explain she was trying to blackmail Frank. Grew up watching SpongeBob in such a scary orbit. Yeah, that's pretty rough. Uh, felt exploding. Yeah, she almost died. 
to examine myself for not having <laughs> come up with drastic but not destructive so say once again but just in case uh -huh, gonna remember be a you so there we're taking over the world talking about being with no excuse so he gave us sorry trying to reach out to me so he, i know he saw terrible things yeah he's still paranoid uh just a little that's fine yeah i, I just i because I, there's from what i've been told there's like little tidbits that's actually important to read in the journal that you might miss if you didn't read that so that's what i'm trying to like feel like i'm missing anything hostile asshole Wiccans. almost killed herself i should have john Mention the roof. She was already in the video. Bone the hold. Step back from the ledge. Alive. I was scratching her arms. After all, I had to talk to the police, make statements. Yeah. Students surrounded me. They started paying off to their heroes. And I'm sure it's the I've learned that I can't blame anyone with multiple fingers. Uh, super honest. Felt cool. Got a hot Maggie butt. Yeah. Enough to kick. Uh, get. Still had to get the 30 degrees. Big needs to tack his office. I was quiet, but getting inside, just replaying the head. Pretty wants to mm -hmm. did amazing the right thing. I'm booted for a few days, which is awesome. That is that is amazing. I don't. I must have done enough, like probably telling him on time, telling Madsen, telling Jefferson. That probably worked out for me in the end. So small justice for Kate. She's being grilled. Mm -hmm. I told Warren something ominous is happening. What is happening, Arcadia Bay? Power to run time. Journal entries. What will Chloe do? Uh, speaking of fear, I think about Kate. Sadness. Leave it to Chloe to make me sneak out for a curfew. Enter the Black Will Ninjas. Alright. Let's do this, baby. Oh, it's unlocked. I oh, hope Samuel shit. isn't around. Dude. This Nothing feels important. Here. Oh, shoot. I'm coming. Can you chill? Can you freaking chill? Nothing but tools. You're nothing but tools. Got him. Really roasted her. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? Ah, yes. The runway fashion. He's just so... <laughs> into the fashion choices. Nuts and bolts. <laughs> like my grandpa's garage. I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves, so who does? Is the game implying that Samuel hurt Rachel? Oh, that's cute. The most magical insects burn bright. Principal uh, Wells, oh, are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Mm. Ah, got He's lucky nobody else saw him like that. Why won't they fit? Except Is he me. drunk? These keys are all broken. Max the ninja strikes again. Let's freaking go. That's what I'm talking about. I didn't know there were ninja mechanics in this game, but what, what can you do? I have, to, I have to control my powers, you know? Give me a heart attack, Booyah. dude. Yeah, like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day. Ruth, I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing. And your badass power is gonna save us all. 
We just need to connect the planes. And find out who almost killed Kate. This from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence between the people around Kate and Rachel. Like Step Prick and Nathan Prescott? Of course. They're both sociopaths. More like psychopaths. The Blackwell security officer even hits his own stepdaughter. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Hmm. Do you think she's... Alive? I have to think that, Chloe. Her spirit is so powerful here. Maybe too much power. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. Oh, you are such a shit. boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. Fair. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Hopefully, the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted, as you know. It's not been a good... Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. If Katie jumped... Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. What the heck? Did she? Well... How does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll do a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know uh... it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together? Oh, God. Is this... Oh, Stupid no. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. Oh, God. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Dang. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm confused why they're meeting here. Looks like Mr. Jefferson might not be as bad as... So stupid. Ooh. Just to make me Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. 